So welcome to my video on dividing mixed numbers. Here we have 3 and 1 third being divided by 2 and 3 fifths. And the first thing I like to do, and I wrote this for you in green, is to convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions and then divide. So that's the first thing I'm going to do. I'm going to convert these mixed numbers into improper fractions. I'll start with 3 and 1 third. I'll convert the 3 and 1 third into an improper fraction. Since our mixed number has a denominator of 3, our improper fraction is also going to have a denominator of 3. And in the numerator, we need to multiply the denominator of 3 by the whole number of 3. So 3 times 3 is 9. And then we need to add the numerator of 1. And this is all being divided with 2 and 3 fifths. So let's do the same thing with that mixed number. We've got to change it into an improper fraction. Since 2 and 3 fifths has a denominator of 5, the improper fraction is also going to have a denominator of 5. And then in the numerator, we need to multiply the denominator of 5 by the whole number of 2. So 5 times 2 is 10. And then we need to add all of that with the numerator of 3. So let's simplify these fractions as much as possible. In our first fraction, we have 9 plus 1 in our numerator. And we know that 9 plus 1 is equal to 10. And our denominator stays the same. And this is being divided with our second fraction, which has a 10 plus 3 in the numerator. And we know that 10 plus 3 is 13. And our denominator stays the same, which is 5. So now we have two fractions being divided with each other. And how do we divide two fractions? Dividing two fractions is exactly the same as multiplying when you flip the second fraction. So instead of dividing by 13 over 5, I'm going to multiply by 5 over 13. 5 over 13 is the reciprocal of 13 over 5. So now I'm going to multiply these two fractions. First, I'm going to multiply my numerators. In our numerator, we have 10 times 5. And now I'm going to multiply the denominators. In our denominator, we have 3 times 13. And now I'm going to scroll down a little bit just to give me a little more space. And now I'm going to simplify this even further. In our numerator, we have 10 times 5, which is just 50. And in our denominator, we have 3 times 13, which is 39. So now we have a final answer of 50 over 39. But since we divided two mixed numbers, our final answer also has to be a mixed number. So we can change 50 over 39 into a mixed number by using long division. I'm going to divide 50 by 39. 39 goes into 50 one time. 1 times 39 is 39. And if we subtract these two numbers, we have a remainder of 11. So since 39 goes into 50 one time, we are going to have a 1 as our whole number. And since we have 11 left over in our remainder, we're going to have an 11 in our numerator. And our denominator stays the same. Since we have a 39 denominator in our fraction, we're going to have a 39 in the denominator of our mixed number. So 50 over 39 is exactly the same as 1 and 11 over 39. And this is our final answer. So here are some more videos with some more example problems related to the video you just watched. I really hope you're finding my tutorials helpful. So until my next video, I will see you later.